Hello and welcome to the session. In this session we discuss the following question which says find the roots of the following equation 1 upon x plus 4 minus 1 upon x minus 7 equal to 11 upon 30 where we have x not equal to minus 4 and 7. Now let's move on to the solution. The equation given to us is 1 upon x plus 4 minus 1 upon x minus 7 equal to 11 upon 30. Now as we have that x is not equal to minus 4 and 7. So multiplying the equation by x plus 4 into x minus 7 we get x plus 4 into x minus 7 whole into 1 upon x plus 4 minus 1 upon x minus 7 equal to x plus 4 into x minus 7 into 11 upon 30. So this gives us x minus 7 minus x plus 4 equal to x plus 4 into x minus 7 into 11 upon 30. That is we get x minus 7 minus x minus 4 equal to x plus 4 into x minus 7 into 11 upon 30. This further implies minus 11 equal to x plus 4 into x minus 7 into 11 upon 30. Now this 11 and this 11 gets cancelled. So this gives us minus 30 equal to x square minus 7x plus 4x minus 28 that is we get x square minus 3x plus 2 equal to 0 so the given equation reduces to this which is a quadratic equation so now from this equation we have a equal to 1, B equal to minus 3 and C equal to 2. So let's find out B square minus 4AC. This would be equal to minus 3 the whole square minus 4 into 1 into 2. This is equal to 9 minus 8 and this is equal to 1. Now you get that B square minus 4AC is greater than 0 since we have this one is greater than 0. Now we know that when b square minus 4ac is greater than 0 then the roots of the equation given by x would be equal to minus b plus minus square root b square minus 4ac upon 2a. So using this we get x equal to minus b that is minus of minus 3 which is 3 plus minus square root b square minus 4ac that is 1 that is square root 1 upon 2a that is 2 into 1 and so this further implies that x is equal to 3 plus minus 1 since square root 1 is 1 upon 2 that is we have x equal to 3 plus 1 upon 2 and 3 minus 1 upon 2 so we get two values for x that is x equal to 2 and x equal to 1. Hence the final answer is that the roots of the given equation are 2 and 1. So now this completes the session. Hope you have understood the solution for this question.